let's do my everyday skincare routine while I answer some of my most asked questions. Literally every time I'm on live. Number one being, why did I move to Florida? Y'all, I low-key feel like I've never said this in the video. I've only like talked about it on live because people always ask me on there. But I moved to Florida years ago when my baby daddy moved to Florida. Um, at the time, we did not have kids. It, he moved here with his family, and then I ended up um, coming down. And, yeah, that's how I ended up in Florida. Like, this was never in my books. Like, I never graduated high school and be like, oh, I wanted to move to Florida. Literally just followed this man down here. Was that probably a mistake? Yes. Did it help me grow and do things I did not think I would do? Yes. So, I feel like it all worked out in some way. <laughs> there was definitely a lot of bumps in the road over the span of like what I don't even know how many years since 2018 so yeah next question the famous do I want any more kids hopefully everybody sees this video so they can stop asking me that because I've stated it before I do it's honestly like a back and forth thought um when I get rich, because I will, I would like more kids. But right now, I feel like mentally, I am not ready for more kids. Especially because I'm always complaining about a break because I have no family here. Um, so, it's just not in my plans right now. I'm not one of those people, no shade, no tea, who pop out kids and, you know, you know. Now, people are always asking me what part of Florida I live in. And personally, I do not feel like, I mean, not don't feel like, I don't. I don't like sharing the direct area. I always just say I live an hour from Orlando. Like, it's just really not safe. And I mean, if you see my surroundings and you want to take it that far to Google, then go ahead. But I will not like ever share like the direct city I live in. If I lived in Orlando, I probably would because Orlando is filled with many, many, many. But I live in like a small area of Florida, so it's kind of easy to pinpoint if that makes sense. So please stop asking me that. <laughs> Let's see, I'm trying to think what else. Family wise, because I feel like a lot of y'all think I don't have family. I literally have all the family that you can imagine. My dad is in my life. I talk to my mom daily. Um, I have a granny. I have cousins. I have aunts. Me and my aunts are actually kind of close in age. They're like, I don't even know how old they are. I think they turn 30, they're in their 30s, early 30s, maybe late 20s. No, they're in their early 30s. <laughs> If I lived back home, then you guys would see my family a lot because they do a lot of get togethers, but I simply don't live at home. So that's why you guys will probably never see my family unless they visit or I visit. Which brings me to my next um, most asked question. Like, do I ever visit home? Does my mom ever visit me? My mom has never came to Florida. I have been back home um, a few times, actually a year after Kaya was born, I moved back home. No, a month after Kaya was born, I moved back home for a year. And when I was pregnant with Noah, I went and then when Noah was like almost one, I think, we went back for Thanksgiving. I probably will not visit back home for a while because Noah is absolutely crazy and I cannot imagine getting on a plane with them by myself. And of course, like like I said, I did it when they were a bit younger, but now Noah's just always on the move. His temper tantrums are a lot worse and I have anxiety, okay? I can't deal with that right now. I can't deal with it, so. Anyways, I probably am missing some questions, but I cannot think of them right now. So if there's anything else y'all wanna know about me that y'all are very intrigued and knowing, then let me know. I try to be very, y'all heard them, I try to be very open with y'all. Just don't go too far now, because y'all know I like to curse people out. Anyways, love you guys. Bye.